What is going on YouTubers? Welcome to another video. Today we're going to be checking out Captain America Sam Wilson by Iron Studios. This is part of their one fourth legacy line, which in general I have collected this entire line. Uh, I did sell off the old Captain and Iron Man and I'm not getting the new Captain. Uh, so I already do have a uh, Sam Wilson when, you know, statue from the Civil War line. And this is obviously him as the new Captain America from the TV series. So that wingspan is insanely wide. And then you have the closed wing, which obviously is going to save you a ton of space. I do think the portrait is fantastic. Looks just as good as their, you know, last one. Uh, the Captain America shield looks good, although I'm pretty confident it's not metal. And ever since I got the Queen version, I do like metal for my shields. So this one obviously looks the best and it gives it the most presence. It's just going to be a space hog. Although if you put it with a bunch of other statues and have some in like, you know, in front right here and right here, it could look really good. If it's on its own, like in a Stuva, this would be the better display option. I mean, overall, I think they did an absolutely outstanding job. Uh, so it's 1330 for the complete, which includes both wings. Closed wings is 1220. Open, 1220. So if you're going to buy this, just go the complete. You're getting the two sets of wings, and it's a $110 more. So I don't know why they would anyone would even buy an open or closed. Even if you're not going to display it, spend the extra 110 because it's going to have better resale value. Yeah, so I have him as Falcon, and I always view him as Falcon, so that it's really hard for me to buy this one just because I always view him as Falcon. I don't need a second one, and I really like my, you know, current Civil War one just because it's, you know, open wing, massive, flying pose, shooting the guns. Look at that width, though. 37 inches, wowzers, and 32 tall. So that is huge, and 28 inches deep. That is going to be incredibly difficult to display. The other one, I think, is 30 inches wide and about 29 inches or 30 inches tall. See, closed wings is not bad at all. 22.4 tall, 14 by 13. So definitely going to be a space hog if you're displaying this due to that massive size, which is just wild. Now, pricing 1330 now, the previous Falcon sold for about $800, and it had a bigger, better base, I'll say. This costume's more vibrant, and I think the wings require more, you know, paint, and overall, that one's much more dull. This is much more vibrant, does have a shield. So, the price isn't too horrible, especially when you consider their most recent Captain, which was very simple, only one switch out, and it was like $1,000. So for 300 more, I think this is a far, far better statue. The only thing I don't care for much is that base. It's very simple. I wish they did something better with that base. That is the worst part of the statue. Now, it's museum pose. But overall, it's a fantastic statue, and it's probably the only one we'll ever get of... Sam Wilson in the Captain America outfit, unless they continue making him Captain America for many, many movies, then we can definitely get some more statues. For me, I am going to pass just because I don't have the space nor the funds for this. But overall, it's an awesome piece, and I do like it. And I think if you have a Marvel collection, you're a huge fan of Sam as Captain, then this is a no-brainer, really. Ships October next year. Uh, so Iron Studios usually does a pretty decent job on delivering on their expected date outside of their Iron Mans. They always have delays on Iron Mans. But this one should probably ship around that time frame. So definitely a cool looking statue, no doubt. And I do give it a thumbs up. I like it for sure. And let's just check to make sure there's no other new statues. I've been playing Resident Evil VR, the Resident Evil 4, for the last like four and a half hours. I've even checked Sideshow's website. We got a Tifa Lockhart. Now, I'm a huge fan of Tifa. This is just a PVC figure, though. And some Iron Man's Medieval by Beast Kingdom. Uh, yeah, I don't really care for any of that stuff. Although, look at this. The Oogie Boogie. That's pretty cool. From Nightmare Before Christmas. Anyways, uh, I really wanted to make this video on 
Captain America, Sam Wilson, because I think this is awesome. I'm a huge fan of Iron Studios, and this definitely deserves a video. So my next statue I'll be getting is going to be Queen Thanos. It arrives next week on Wednesday, but I won't get it till Thursday. Like, I won't be able to open it till Thursday. Uh, I'm... Uh, I'll still be uploading some content for you guys, but, uh, yeah. Uh, Queen Thanos is the next one, and then probably Black Widow after that, uh, which I'm really excited for. Uh, and then hopefully Iron Studios puts up their Scarlet Witch and Vision soon, because those are two I do plan to pre-order. Uh, Captain America and Falcon, you know, I do like this, and if I had unlimited funds in space, I would buy it, but I do have to be cognizant of my space and money so this is a pass for me but what do you guys think do you, are you any of you guys going to be buying this uh if you are which version are you going to get i mean in my mind i see the complete version as the only one to buy to give you both options and it's not that much more expensive you know even if you only plan to display the close wing i would still pay extra for the complete just for resale and who knows what if one day you did want to display open wing so that's what i think so, definitely an awesome piece, though. Uh, I do lo love Iron Studio Marvel statues. And he is getting a fourth solo movie, which is really nice. So, this can definitely, you know, have a lot of appeal when that movie comes out, especially if it's an epic movie. So, if any of you are interested in pre-ordering this, please use the link in the description below. It does help the channel so I can buy more statues and bring you guys more content. Because there's a lot of statues I want to buy. And, uh... Would love to, you know, get them and unbox and review them for you guys on the channel. So if you are buying any statues in general, please use the links in the description below uh, so we can get more statues in the cave. Uh, I did want to quickly show you my other Sam Wilson. Alexa, turn on Marvel statue room lights. So I'm a huge fan of this one in particular. It does have a switch out. Uh... That hand has like a forward, like he's commanding the little, uh, that little guy, I forget his name. But, you know, this one has a huge base, quite intricate and detailed. It's connecting, very wide wingspan. And the likeness on this is outstanding. You can actually see his eyes inside of the, like, little glasses he's wearing. So, I'm a huge fan of this piece. It's actually... My favorite in this entire diorama is Falcon because of the pose, the wings. I love like big wide wing type characters, you know, like Marcus and Falcon. This is uh, the most impressive piece in this entire display. Uh, even if he's not my favorite character, you know, like Captain and Iron Man more, that's the best statue, no doubt, due to the pose and everything. And I still do like this pose better than the newer statue. The newer statue is good for museum. This is more action because he's actually like flying. So I still think this is a better statue to be honest. But the new one is him as Captain America, which would also look really cool in a display. Uh, so, yep, I uh, just wanted to show that to you guys. Uh, yeah, Queen Thanos will arrive shortly. And he's going to go right here. Although if he doesn't look good down low, I'll just switch him with this and do him right there. So we'll see how that turns out. Otherwise, hope you guys all enjoy this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Have a great day.